channel. I've uh, changed my uh, upload again. I tried it on the first days, but that was not a success. I could clearly see that. So uh, I'm back to Sundays now. Uh, what you saw in the clip before you saw my face was this my new camera, which is a uh, Nikon FE. I'm sorry about the sound, by the way, I don't have any microphone today. But as you can see, there's no screen on the back because this is in a film camera. Uh, I've decided to, uh, to go back to shooting film again, uh, 35 mil. Uh, and today there's a black and white uh, film in this camera. But the uh, images won't be, uh, uh, won't be developed and scanned and so on for this video. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you some of the first images that I made with this uh, camera and, and talk you through them. Um, but I'll do that when I get back at the office. So we'll see you back in the office. By the way, before we go back to that, I got some amazing news. Uh, apart from that camera and me shooting film again. Um, an hour ago, I just got my uh, first shot of the vaccine against COVID-19. So, and I feel fine, uh, no problems. So that's just freaking awesome. I'm really happy about that. So, uh, and I'm going back to uh, Going home, having a cup of coffee, uh, a chat with the dog, if you can have that. And uh, and then I'll show you those images I promised you just two seconds ago. So yeah, see you then. the office um, I've, um, well there's not no no images now from uh, from out there uh, that are going to the lab but I just uh, uh, got uh, the images back from the lab that I promised you uh, and I'm very sorry that this uh, was postponed but this took a lot longer than I expected so uh, maybe they uh, are more busy than I, uh, I anticipate um, I've been shooting with this uh, Fuji Chrome um, Sensia 200, which is a film that was uh, made, I think, for the uh, Korean uh, Japan, um, um, what's it called, the World Cup in some, I don't know. It's an official film that says here on the back, you can see that. But um, it's expired, uh, it, it's from 2003, so uh, it's a quite an old film, I had to, uh, to um, well, to cover that, to uh, to um, to expose for that, uh, I'll get back to that maybe in another, another video, not today. And then uh, the other one was not this one; it was an old um, Coda Color uh, VR Plus 200 something, also an expired film um, that I was uh, shooting. With. And I will uh, let's uh, let's have a look at the images right here. So if I you see, I've, I've just chosen. Um, a few of those. Uh, let's start with the um, let's start with the Kodak Kodak color film. Um, clearly, as you can see, um, there's some uh, I don't know dust or something, and uh, funny uh, line up here, and uh, and um, yeah. But I 
some think the colors are, are, are nice and uh, I like the look of this and uh, yeah it's, it's just great but as you can see over here I clearly have a problem uh, with uh, scanning something called the uh, Newton rings uh, it's because when you have uh, something uh, like a bent area something that's bent that's been scanned by something flat or how, how else I don't know how to put it but um, but uh, then uh, this uh, phenomenon uh, occurs um, and clearly that's a problem um, I did have some uh, some other films some uh, black and white films uh, that were also um, they also came from the lab and I didn't have that problem, but they were not as old as these two uh, color films that you were looking into today, so maybe they have a tendency to bend more, I don't know, but uh, yeah. Um, next one is just uh, this, well, you can clearly see uh, the point of this, <laughs> the shapes up here and the, the shapes over here in the shadows, um, but as you can see, is there again that um, Newton ring and of course there's grain and stuff like that but uh, I don't mind that's part of shooting film and that's <laughs> I kind of like that so it's nice um, night photography uh, I will talk some more about this image I think uh, like in, you can clearly see I haven't been that good at uh, getting rid of the dust uh, and stuff like that in these images I, I really was careful but I don't know why there's so much of this and some strange lines and also this uh, neutron thingy here again but but uh, I'll get back to these because uh, these night photography shots uh, there's one more here uh, actually came out as a surprise uh, and this uh, this new camera that I will get back to in another video <coughs> next week I hope um, can do a lot more than I just imagined so yeah and this is um, again nice colors uh, nice well basically everything uh, I just like it but there's a lot of dust spots but uh, but let's move on to the next film and have a look at that uh, like this now this is strange um, this is strange because you have this weird line going all the way through the picture up here and I cannot tell you why uh, and it's like it's there down here again it's like there's some kind of I don't know I don't know I have a suspicion that um, it might be something um, in the lab in fact I'm not so I'm not going to tell you who did this um, I don't know and this down here, this is clearly, I think, is the scanning software try, trying to get rid of all these uh, spots here. So I think some of these images need um, need a new scan. And by the way, in case in case you're wondering, this is art. Uh, this is an art piece that uh, it's it's symbolizing that um, the refugees is having uh, difficulties coming into the Western countries. That's how I remember it. So. Yeah, but um, I don't know about you, but I think I, I like the look of these images. Uh, this one again, um, nice shadows, nice highlights, nice colors and all that. Uh, but again, something weird, and this is in fact not this uh, Newton uh, thing again. It's again like a band of something um, coming across, and I do think it's from the uh, development of this film. Um, they might not have, yeah, there must be something wrong with their machine or if they've done this by hand, I don't think they have, but, well, you never know. Um, this is in fact not a negative, it is a positive film, this, uh, this is a slight film, uh, this Fuji thing, but uh, yeah. But look at those colors, and this is uh, straight out of cam. Uh, I do think I've, uh, I've uh, tuned this down a bit, but I haven't touched the colors, I haven't done any uh, sharpening or anything, and it's, it's not like it's tax sharp, but I, uh, well, yeah, I like this. It looks, it's not the image itself, the composition, the com com composition is not uh, anything to, to talk about, but, but I like the colors. Um, 
and ordered that again from a shop. Um, and there again, this stupid Newton ring. But but yeah, so a bit uh, well, a lot of grain in the sky, but but there should be uh, a lot of grain in there. But but yeah, but yeah, it's nice. It's nice. I just like it. Um, and again, as I told you, I did not manipulate, manipulate any colors or anything here. So um, this is just uh, as is. So that's not that's not bad. And just a funny thing, shooting into a window, window directly. So yeah. Um, what I'll do now, I'll just do a, a slight uh, retouch uh, on some of these, remove some of the, the dust specks and uh, and so on. And I will uh, show you them uh, in the end of this video. So, uh, so uh, well, in conclusion to all this, I'm just I, maybe you can you can sense that I I, um, I hate those new rings. I, 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 I really don't um, like them, and I need to figure out how to um, how to deal with that. I need to somehow to flatten these um, the negatives or the film strips um, to um, to be able to get rid of these. Um, I don't know if I can put them in some hot water and put them under some pressure and then straighten them out or something, but I, I'll have to to, uh, to test that. But I just thought I'd show you these uh, anyhow. Um, so some of these, the, I picked the best of these, the images from these days, uh, with these two films, and I will uh, certainly do a new scan of those. Um, so uh, yeah, that, that's nice. But. But apart from that, um, as I was saying, I hope you can you can tell that I'm I'm pretty excited about this. I, I really like this uh, shooting film, getting back to that again, and and also I I very much like my new camera, um, and I'm going to uh, to tell you more about that next week. So I hope you uh, you enjoyed this little uh, teaser uh, for film photography, and I hope to see you next week uh, where I will be talking about camera and uh, and my my new lenses my old and new lenses oh i oh you shouldn't have you shouldn't have i shouldn't have told you that sure ah, doesn't matter see you next week thanks for watching bye